Hello, in this video I'm going to show you the top tricks on the TCL60 SE NXT Paper 5G. Okay, so let's begin. Uh, so maybe the first thing that I'm going to show you is uh, actually, uh, I think the best uh, feature on this device uh, is of course the ink mode. Uh, to switch between those modes because, you know, currently as you take a look, uh, it looks like I, you know, I have normal icons, everything looks normal. Uh, but to switch between those modes, uh, as you take a look, uh, in here we have this uh, switch button, and now we need to move it to the upside, just like that. Uh, and now we can select the NXT paper mode. So um, we have a uh, color uh, paper mode, uh, it's uh, our um, one of our modes. Uh, we have the ink paper mode and the max ink mode. Now, let me show you all of that option. So let's begin with the color paper mode. And let's select that and let's click on enter mode. And now we will take a look what's going to happen. Boom. So now, as you can see, our, uh, our wallpaper disappeared. Mm. And now we are in this uh, mode. It's, it basically looks like a uh, simple mode. As you can see, everything wo works though. Uh, and for example, in this mode, uh, the device should work uh, simply better. Uh, it should be uh, much faster than normally. Uh, also, uh, we have the matte uh, screen. Mm, it's also pr uh, pretty comfortable uh, in touch. Uh, so that's one of the uh, one of the modes. Uh, that's the color version. Mm, now. I'm going to move it to the downside and now to the upside once more. Okay, and now let's select the ink paper mode. We will have the black and white uh, ink display. Click on enter mode. And this mode is also mm, uh, good for reading. Boom, you can see now uh, how this phone uh, looks like uh, and remember that uh, everything uh, will work still so for example i can open up the uh, i don't know maybe the the youtube and i should take a look everything still works so it's pretty pretty cool mm, i would say mm, that everything still works just fine Mm. Also, in this mode, the battery consumption will be simply uh, lower than on the normal mode because there are no colors to be mm, shown uh, when you have <laughs> black and white uh, colors. So, uh, and now let me uh, switch to the normal mode once more, uh, and I'll show the uh, last uh, last mode. So now I'm gonna switch to the upside once again, and now we have the max ink mode. Click on enter. And now uh, the, all of the apps that are running uh, will be closed. Click on yes. Now let's wait until we will get access into the mode. Okay. Uh, and in here uh, we don't have uh, as much uh, many options that we had uh, before because we are in that max ink uh, mode. And in here we can only open up the uh, phone app, messages, contacts, settings, calculator, Google Play Store. Uh, yeah. Uh, and in here we can find some books. We can open up the calculator, calendar, uh, start button, clock, and we can add some more apps as you can see still. For example, Facebook, game uh, manager, game center, and that kind of stuff. And as you click on start, you open up uh, some kind of a Microsoft store, I would say. Uh, and basically this mode is used for, uh, you know, uh, reading, basically. So I'm sure that in here you can find some books to download or to buy. Uh, and yeah, that's how it works. And uh, Okay, so now uh, I'll go back into the normal mode. So I'm gonna switch to the downside. This is switch. All right. Now let's open up the settings. Now, uh, in under the NXT paper zone, uh, we can s uh, select the action for uh, our uh, key. Uh, we have the mode selector that uh, I have just shown you, but we can also uh, enable the enter immediately mode, if you want. So now basically we won't have uh, this menu, I'll show you that, I'll switch to the upside right now. And as you can see, no menu appeared, 
and we are already in our uh, last um, NXT paper mode. So in my case, I'm in that uh, maximum uh, ink mode. So now I'll go back into the normal mode. Okay, now let's open up the settings. Uh, below we have uh, those modes. Uh, and in here you can uh, select and the mode that you want uh, but uh, those options are only uh, available uh, when uh, we have the enter immediately mode enabled i'll just leave the uh, mode selector i think it's the best uh, okay now let's scroll down to the downside a little bit uh, i'll only adjust the brightness mm, now let's go into the uh into the advanced features and now uh, I'll open the quick gestures first uh, and as one of the gestures we have the three finger screenshot uh, so now we need to swipe down with three fingers sim uh, simultaneously to take a screenshot uh, you know uh, the basic option to create a screenshot is basically by clicking the power button and the volume down button just like that that's the normal option how to create uh, how to make a screenshot but now let's slide with our three fingers and now as you can see this screenshot has been successfully taken i'm going re to repeat that just like that and now the screenshot is made uh, all right below we have the power key mm, options uh, we can uh, quickly open the camera we can uh, end calls uh, or we can uh, select the access for the long press uh, power menu uh, so now uh, when i'll ta double tap the uh, power button twice it should uh, launch the camera so let's try okay as you can see the camera app has been successfully uh, launched we can you know switch between the rear camera and the front camera we can see me waving we can create a quick photo in each mode so everything works uh, properly let's get back in here now let's enable the power button and call so basically now if someone will be calling us all you need to do is to tap the power button to end the call uh, and the long press power key uh, if you hold normally the power menu will launch but we can also enable for the uh, digital assistant we can also below now uh, select the long press duration simply grab uh, this bar and move left or right to select it uh, on short or on long i'll just leave it in the middle now i'll hold and now uh, you can enable the, the google assistant as you can see and it's uh, already uh, registering my voice okay and uh, now below we have the tcl ai we have the text assist Make sure it's enabled so in some apps long press the text and drag it into the shortcut to quickly uh, summarize translate or rewrite it uh, okay i'm wondering what are those uh, some apps maybe let's open up the uh, simple notes i'm going to create one okay and now when i'll hold the text something should happen but currently it doesn't want to work but we can open up the sidebar by performing this move just like me uh, and now we have the writing assist mm, and now we can uh, for example mm, actually uh, i don't know it's is that actually the thing that i wanted to get uh, In here, in that case, it doesn't want to work. You know that <coughs> holding the the text, but maybe the note apps uh, are not required for that. But uh, in the search bar, just I have shown you, uh, for example, we have the writing assets, and here um, the app welcomes us. Hello, I can help you write. And in here, you can um, select what you want to read. Let's say the uh, the email. And now enter the subject. So let's say holiday. Boom. Click on agree. But first, as you can see, if you want to use that feature, you need to have your TCL account created. 
so it doesn't want uh, it doesn't work every time uh, we also have the riding assist we need to perform that kind of move and that's the riding assist that I have shown you so you can get quick access to it by performing that move you don't need, you don't need to you know open up the, the smart sidebar uh, you can quickly uh, get access to it by performing this move and there's also the uh, smart voice and uh, memory uh, so mm, you can record meetings using smart voice memo uh, which allows you to transcribe recordings into text and generate summaries and mind uh, maps let me show you how it works so let's open up this uh, sidebar let's select smart voice memory uh, allow for recording and now as you can see the uh, recording has uh, started now my voice is being uh, registered so now let's uh, save this mm, recording now let's hold uh, sorry don't hold let's click normally uh, and now we can create a summary mind map uh, or we can transcribe uh, it by clicking uh, transcribe but in my case uh, my audio is uh, too short i don't know why so basically it needs to be uh, a little bit longer than mine and uh, here you will be able to use that ai features Alright, well that's all in this video, thank you all for watching, if you found this video helpful, please leave a like, comment and subscribe.